हेलो ऑल वेलकम टू साइक्लो एडिशन रिएक्शन पार्ट थ्री ओके फॉर अदर पार्ट यू कैन चेक द लिंक ओवर हियर इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दिस क्वेश्चन इट इज फ्रॉम जून 2014 इन डाई हिल्स अल्डो रिएक्शन द मोस्ट रिएक्टिव डाई इन अमंग्स द फॉलोइंग इज रिगार्डिंग इन डाई हिल्स अल्डो रिएक्शन वी हैव वन थ्री ब्यूटाडाइन टाइप्स प्लस वन इथीन मॉलिक्यूल ओके सो दिस डबल वन फॉल्स है दिस डबल वन फॉल्स है एंड दिस डबल वन विल फॉल यर लीडिंग टू द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ दिस प्रोडक्ट ओनली वन डबल वन विल रिमेन दिस इज कॉल्ड एज द डायल चल्डर रिएक्शन एंड रिमेंबर डायल चल्डर रिएक्शन इट इज अलाउड ओनली थर्मली ओनली इट इज अलाउड थर्मली एंड फोटोकेमिकली इट इज नॉट अलाउड and this is example of 4 plus 2 cyclo addition reaction uh, the next thing is that we have to remember that these this or these double bond they should be conjugated once the conjugation it is not there they will not undergo this reaction because it has the double bond the electrons they have to move in the cyclic fashion so conjugated conjugation it is important regarding a if you draw the structure it is this can be the structure yes and here we are it is uh, stating 4e so one position second third and the fourth e means they will be trans this double bond and these two substituent will be trans now what happens are they conjugated the first important question is it conjugated it is not conjugated and this will not at all give the diel salder reaction so option a it is wrong because it is not in the conjugation mode the next part will be b here it is having 4 uh, z or 4z 1 for hexadiene again if you draw the structure we have we are having a double bond here 1 2 3 4 ओके सो वन फोर हेक्साडाइन केस एंड दिस वन इट इज इन द जी कंडीशन इफ यू बोथ ग्रुप्स आर इन द ऑन द सेम साइड सो सिस और जी द नेक्स्ट थिंग इज इज इट कॉन्जुगेटेड अगेन सिंस इट इज देर इज एस पी टू हाइब्रिडाइज कार्बन यर सॉरी एस पी थ्री हाइब्रिडाइज कार्बन देर इज नो कॉन्जुगेशन सिंस देर इज नो कॉन्जुगेशन दिस विल नॉट गिव डायल्स अंडर रिएक्शन एट ऑल when you consider option c it is 2e 4e and 24 hexadiene 24 hexadiene if we draw the structure it will be like this 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 so 2 4 so at second position and fourth position we can draw the double bond now regarding 2e if you check these two substituents they are trans to each other so it is e now regarding at the fourth position again these two uh, bonds are trans to each other so again it is e okay so this will give diels alder reaction now what about d we are having uh, 2z 4z hexadiene uh, it is 1 sorry 2 4 hexadiene yes it is 2 4 hexadiene so if you draw the structure here it will be 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 so again at the 2 and 4 position we are having the diene and if you consider these two substituents they are cis to each other that's why it is z again in this condition they are cis cis to what there is a double bond here so these bonds are cis to each other so again it is z now what happens so this will also give diel salder reaction because the double bonds they are conjugate in conjugation so they will give diel salder reaction now which one will give a at a faster rate the most reactive one will be this part the reason being when ethene is approaching a two electron system it is approaching this part it is away and this this part will not repel this if you bring ethene from this side what will happen because of steric factor the rate of the reaction will be lowered because this part 
will try to repel this ethene making it a lesser reactor than this it is reactor but lesser than this both will give dial solder reaction but because of this position this will give faster so option c it is the right choice